Hello and welcome to another video. In today's video we'll be doing yet another demo. This is for a game called The Plague Doctor of Opera. This game came out in on the 5th of October this year. So it is currently available on Steam. I will put a link to it in the description down below. Um, so the bar says here, or the description says, The plague spreads agony and fear in the small town of Opera. As a plague doctor you will bring healing and relief whenever you can. But ignorance, superstition, and religious zeal make it for, make for a deadly threat in this retro medieval medical adventure. So, it looks like a retro type of game, like a 90s type of game. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Start a new game. We have a little visit. Hello, Georgie. Hello. It's my dog Georgia. She's here to try to get some food. Dear Professor, I'm writing to you from Wipper, a town in central Germany. I think I got a click. Here the plague has struck particularly hard and tires like trained physicians. And so I have been sent to Wipper to help care for the afflicted. Today was my first day in the local conven convent hospital. As a plague doctor, I have had to offer condolences to many patients, children and relatives, where there was nothing more to be done for their loved ones. But now I believe I have discovered the cause of this plague. Oh, I wonder what it was. The day's events have sparked numerous insights that formed the basis of my theory. But let me start at the beginning. Your precious girl. Yeah, you can't be the doggy barking. Hey. <laughs> Time to put the dog there. Say bye, Georgie. Bye. Okay. I hope we're wearing pants or shorts. Sleep shorts. Oh, she's lying down. Okay, so now we dress. The sun is really high in the sky. I'm feeling sure plenty of work awaits me at the hospital. Um, but first, I have a house call to make. The basket weaver has asked me to look at him and, and his sick child. I will surely encounter situations today where I will need to consider my actions carefully. Okay, so we're going to get multiple options. I'm well aware that position can we have. Okay, I am well aware. That my decisions can have far reaching consequences, or I prefer to let fate surprise me. Let's go for that one. However, I am well aware that my decisions can have far reaching consequences. Yes, we just read that. I should gather what I need before setting off. A sharp knife. I've had to use to, to excise dead flesh. My bag. I have my bag. I should pack my things now. Let's take the knife. Uh, Handbook on modern medicine, a reference book of various diseases and their treatments. It's a good thing I've got the book on me. If I ever get stuck on a case, I can refer to it. I have everything. Yeah? A portrait of my father, himself a respectable physician. Sorry, the neighbours were making a bit of a noise. Take much from the rich and little from the poor was his advice to me. Robin Hood, a winter coat, a precious garment, but smile that side. Okay, the plague doctor of Wipra. So I'm guessing we're in Europe, obviously, because he's in Germany. I'm not going to put on any accents. I can't do accents. Looks good so far. It's very retro. I remember playing games like this when I was a kid. Eh? It's just naughty next to me. Craft is Ellie. Basket Weaver's house must be here. God be with you. My name is Oswald Keller. I'm the new physician in the hospital. Ah, the doctor. I'm Arnold from the City Watch. 
What is it? I'm looking for the house of the basket beaver. What happened here? Oh, I'm curious. What happened here? What does it look like? Cutlass came down with the plague. Must have had a rapid decline. His wife already slipped it now out with the brats. I'd be sealing them up in there too. Oh, they escaped. Why is that? The mayor issued the order today. Otherwise, people refuse to take us in there. Refuse to isolate, he says. Besides, empty houses attract looters and keeping them up. Order is hard enough already. I'm looking for the house of the basket weaver. It's over there on the other side of the street, under the garbage. Under all the garbage. I don't want to keep you from your work. That's it. Okay, so. Uh, loudly. <coughs> Gladly negotiating a price for the pig. Oh, chickens. I guess he misses it. Yes, there's a basket. I have to just get the rats away first. Uh, okay, how can I speed the rats away? Rats, the so numerous now they become fearless. It must be where the plague is coming from. Um, a wooden stick. That makes sense. Use a wooden stick to scare the rats off. I've scared the rats off. Knock, knock. Good day. I'm the physician, new physician. Oswald Keller is my name. Your husband asked me to pay you a visit. Took the killer and place you here. Please come in. Close the door quick. Please, the rats will get in. Thank you. It's gotten so bad with these rats lately. My husband is out to the market right now. I'm sure he will too soon. What exactly is the trouble? Please take a little look at us, Sven. Something is wrong with him. He won't get out of bed, refuses to eat, and complains of pain. He's probably got the plague. There's a little patient, but I can't examine him in the dark. Um, let's see. Um, can I get some light? What can you tell me about his condition? Three days ago, he was running around the street as brother, like usual. Then he suddenly felt sick. He took to his bed and just made the innocence. It's too dark to examine him. Could you get some light in here? I can't examine you, said the dark. I'd like to, Doctor, but the baby. You think you can manage the light yourself? Please, take whatever you need. Hold on a second. Go. 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 Okay. Uh, I heat the room with this incense burner. It's radiating a lot of heat. Okay. Stick doesn't catch fire. Um a basket full of laundry. Balls and a lamp. Ah, oh, yes, to take the lamp. I have the lamp, but then you feel it awake. Can you put this stick in there? Hmm. Simple wooden stick. Good. The lamp lacks fuel and a wick. Jacob. A jack and bowl of beef tallow. Okay, so we see the net. Plate of sack of plates. Dried herbs tied with a long string. Please go ahead and provide some light. Let me take whatever you need. I saw the kid, maybe he's got something. Hello, little man. Hello, doctor. I need space for my examination. You moved to the other saw. 
I'm already gone. Um. Hmm. It's too dark, I can't see anything. Let's hunt to do a... Oh! I carve a long chip out of the stick. Long chip. Okay. Can I light this? Okay, well I've lit the stick. Where did it go? I guess I have to hurry. Hmm. What can I use for fuel? Cut off the long dangly string. I have to fill the lamp with fuel. Oh, maybe the beef teller? Yes. Like the stick, and then we go. We have light. Okay, let's spin up going to examine you now. Ooh, he be naked. His heart is beating fast. Apart from that, nothing unusual can be seen on the upper body. There's small dust in the calves and the ankle end. I know these dark spots. Hello, mister. Dr. Oswald Keller. Good day. One moment, please. I have to look at Sven's brother, too. But They've got the plague. Redded flea bites, just like Sven's, but no spots. It's good. <coughs> I'm afraid I have some bad news for you. I observed many flea bites in Sven's legs, but unfortunately, also dark spots. There are signs of the plague. Oh no! What are you saying? Please, listen to me. I know this is terrible news, but there's still a chance of recovery. The pestilence hasn't produced far yet. What should we do now? Give Sven plenty to drink. He also needs fresh air. Fresh air? But the rats are outside the window. Yes, I know. I tried to come up with something. Stay away. Don't leave the house, there's a new regulation. I'll come back later today and help you, somehow. Show the book, it's got the plague. Dr. Keller, a word. What is the reason for your visit to the basket weaver? Um, a simple fever. No cause for alarm. Is that so? Remember, Dr. Keller, every case of plague must be reported, even if it means another door for me to seal. Yes, I'm aware of that. Good day to you. I have to help this family. That help, they'll either have to leave their child or all die together. I'm sure I'll think of something at the hospital. I hope we can save him. We can save if he does. Hmm. Uh, how do I leave? I'm pretty sure I came from this way. Thank you for playing the demo of the Plague Doctor of Wupra. Well, it's a bit of a short video, but I enjoyed it. It was an enjoyable experience. I hope you enjoyed watching me play it. And yes, as I said, it's available in Steam right now for purchase. I'll put a link in the description down below. And if you liked what you saw, feel free to buy it. I'm not getting any commission out of this. They're not paying me to say this stuff. But yeah. Anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to be alerted when I upload my next video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!